Hi, it's David from My Business English at YouTube, and today we're looking at the third conditional for the Unreal Past. Looking back at the past and thinking how things could have been different. So we're looking back at the past, thinking about reasons or causes and their results and effects. Sometimes we look back and think, gee, that was bad what we did, and the result was terrible. Sometimes, though, it's positive. We look back and think, yeah, that was really smart. That was really good what we did, and the result was good too. Let's look at some examples and how we make the third conditional. So, we need if and had or hadn't, a third form of the verb or past participle, would or wouldn't, have, verb three. If we had reacted quicker, we wouldn't have lost the client. Let's look at the reason or cause statement. If we had reacted quicker, what's the fact? What's the cause? They did not react quickly. That's the fact. We wouldn't have lost the client. What's the fact? What's the result? They did lose the client. Third fact, they're not happy about that at all, so they're expressing regret. Quick look at speaking, how we contract the function words, the auxiliary verbs, which aren't really so important. If we'd, if we'd reacted, we wouldn't, we wouldn't have, we wouldn't have lost the client. Let's look at another version. This time we're a bit more happy about the past. If plus had, verb three, sold, wouldn't, would not, have, verb three, made. Let's look at the cause statement. If we had sold the Apple shares in 2003, fact, they did not sell the shares. We wouldn't have made so much money. Result, fact, they made lots of money. And they're very, very happy about what happened. If we had sold the Apple shares in 2003, we wouldn't have made so much money. In speaking, if we'd, if we'd sold, we wouldn't, we wouldn't have, we wouldn't have made so much money. And negative forms like wouldn't tend to be a bit more stressed, so we wouldn't have made so much money. Let's look at one more example where this time we've put the if clause second. So the result comes first and the reason or cause second. The project would have finished on time if we hadn't had such bad weather. In fact, the project didn't finish on time. Why? What's the cause? They had very bad weather. Speaking. The project would have, would have finished on time. If we hadn't, again, hadn't is negative, so it needs to be stressed. If we hadn't had such bad weather. One thing to remember for writing is that when we have the if clause second, there's no comma. If clause first, comma, but if clause second, no comma. So, I hope that was useful for you. Please share and subscribe to the My Business English at YouTube channel. And you may be interested in my Grammar Songs for Learning English at YouTube as well. Have a great day.